Lala here with Jaren. How you feeling? What's up? Yes. So, um, my voice sounds a little crazy, but it's fine. Um, so we're gonna do this raspy thing. So, Jared, how long have you been like dancing? Like, what brought you to community? You know, like what brought you here? Yeah. Like, tell us a little about yeah. yourself. Yeah. So I've been dancing for seven seven years now. I okay. started in. So I was born and raised in Hawaii. Oh, nice. I started That's doing nice. like Polynesian, like hula stuff yeah you know, oh. like and stuff yeah um, so nice. I started with that that was my okay. first um, kind of form of okay. dance nice and so um, you can imagine how stiff all of this was <laughs> getting into hip-hop and then I, I, uh, I uh, came out to Southern California for school okay I went to Azusa Pacific University hey. uh, <laughs> and that's where I found hip-hop I actually started okay. hip-hop oh very late okay how late. old are you tell, uh, how, tell. how old would you how, how old would you guys you're 12 guess? Right? yes okay cool. exactly so I'm you've been 12. dancing since you were since i was 10. Four. Okay. Yeah. awesome i'm just kidding uh, <laughs> I, I am know. i'm 28 years old you're, no you're yeah. not mm -hmm. <laughs> um nice. yeah so 28 years old i think i, okay. I started uh hip-hop at 21. Oh wow, twenty one. Okay, twenty nice. twenty one. Yeah, you did start so, late, but that's dope. I, did, I started pretty late, nice. but it's it's this thing that I tell everyone when you're really passionate about something. Yeah, you know, it's yeah. just you naturally want to put all your effort and energy into that one thing. Yeah, absolutely. And, and you can't beat that type of motivation. Yeah, like when you got all of that. Yeah, you can go anywhere. That's you can grow so... as fast as you want to grow. Ooh. Yeah. Okay, okay, with that, yeah. who who would you say is, like, your biggest inspiration? Like, who oh. do you look to? Like, how did you, like, did you start, like, in breaking? Did you start, like, freestyling? Mm. Like, who do you look up to? Who are your mentors? Who so, you trained with? So, I started in, in choreography. I just, oh, okay. I, yeah, a just friend brought in. me out to a workshop, and nice. I was like, I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah. And then immediately fell in love with it. Oh. Immediately. And um, I think this was, like, on the precipice of when... Um, YouTube was starting to, you know, ramp up and all yeah. these dance videos started coming out, yeah. you know? Um, and, um, Keone, I'm sure, oh, like, nice. I'm oh. sure everyone, yeah, you know, it's amazing. just, but Keone is just, I mean, so many groundbreaking things, Yeah, he, yeah you know, lot, just yeah. from mentality, mindset, to work ethic, right. to, um, what he's really kind of bringing out now, which yeah. is storytelling, yeah. and, and polyrhythms, how he kind of introduced that to the world, so it's just kind of like, always looking for something more yeah you know and never never giving up and that's where i find the motivation to to tell myself and others that if you're willing to put in the work right and you want to do this then yeah. you can nice you know okay fun, okay let's do a fun one you ready for this one okay if you were a superhero <laughs> in dance who would you be <sighs> if i was a superhero like if i was a superhero that yeah. also dance correct Oh man, this would be a hard one. <laughs> Dang. He's like Superman. I'm just like I'm like thinking of all these. It, it'd probably be um uh I think because he already kind of like dances a little bit, uh, but it'd probably be like Doctor Strange. Really? I actually I really see love that. Doctor Strange. Nice. I see and I, I don't know how to touch. You know, I really would yeah. like to touch. So if I was Doctor Strange, then be, and then I'd be casting spells at the same time. You know. Okay. Boom, butterflies. So that's your name now. <laughs> I actually, when I first started dancing, one of my first workshops was here at Boogie Zone. No way. And it was uh it was when Snow Glow Perspective uh, was first starting out. Yes I am. And so. and they had um uh Jaime Soriano was oh, teaching. Yes. Um Shen Poon was <laughs> teaching. Um uh, man. And so just to come back yeah. and be here in that position is like it's such an honor and yeah. it's such a blessing. Yeah. And this place like like, it's I mean, old. you know, that's where I started. Yeah. Like, this is part of where I started. Yeah, and, for that's, sure. and that's, I know that's the same for so many people. Yeah, absolutely. You know? and that's that's how, I, how I feel, too. This is, like, my home. This yeah. is, like, I'm from Oklahoma originally. I moved out yeah. here. Elm, Boogie, like, he gives opportunities. He mm -hmm. and just, like, you grow and you fly. And it's yeah. Great. Like, it's home. That's and that's, like, I mean, pfft. Yeah. Yeah. Elm is great. He is great. Thanks so much for being with us. Do you have, like, mm -hmm. hashtags, anything you're working on, anything you want to say? Um, my Instagram is with dot Jared. Oh. So if you wanna, you know, I don't know, follow me. And mine's Lala Blush Crew. Follow me that. <laughs> <Just kidding. laughs>
<laughs> We're so subtly. <laughs> awesome. Well, thank you so much for having us again, Jared. All of his information. I'm Lala Blush Crew. We love you. We use our utopia. We use our uh, community class worldwide. All of that. We out. Desperate. Uh, 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 uh. There should be music at the end. And we're out. And we can keep it on. You know, we can keep to. going. It's so fun. They're literally not telling us to rap. So, okay. guess we're just gonna oh, I got going. you. Oh, oh, ooh, get it, fuck it up, fuck it up. We about to rap, I'm about to take my glasses off because it's hot as crap. Let's go, let's go, hit hey, it. Hey. Oh, am I rapping or are you oh, rapping? Oh, no, no, I, was, I, was, I, I just wanted to be the